Barcelona is finally back on track, dominating, playing expressive football. Xavi's tactics are finally deployed. But, 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 there is just one problem here. The Osman Dembele situation, which needs to be resolved quickly. Let's talk today about this on Mehu Talks Football. It's all going smoothly now because Barcelona got four key signings in the January transfer window. They finally got Xavi as their manager and now things are looking very very good for Barcelona I must say. They are playing expressively, they are dominating free flow direct football which is enjoyable at best which was not seen under Ronald Koeman and now after signing Obama Yang, Ferran Torres, Danny Alves, Arma Traore, Barcelona's attacking options have widened to such an extent that they can play any three front three, any game, and nobody would predict their lineup anymore. But there is a certain player which is causing some controversy in the Barcelona club. That is Osman Dembele. Osman Dembele, before we break down the video, before we get into the depths of the video, let us understand who Osman Dembele is. Osman Dembele is a French international. He plays for Barcelona and he joined back in 2017. But his Barcelona journey has not been great so far and I don't think it ever will be. Osman Dembele signed a contract in 2017 from Borussia Dortmund on a fee of more than 100 million pounds. But has he lived up to its name? Has Osman Dembele justified his price tag? I, price tag, I must say. No. He has just scored only 32 goals in his Barcelona career, which is, which is from 2017 to till now to 2022. Imagine a player scoring 32 goals in five and a half years. You would term him as shit, just straight up shit. He has been shit for Barcelona, you must say. He, his, he has not justified his price tag. But that's not the point of the video. The point is Barcelona and Osman Dembele were emerged in contract talks in January, as you all know. But then hell broke loose and Osman Dembele contract renewal talks broke down. Why? Let me tell you why. Oh, Barcelona were offering Dembele a contract renewal, a long term contract, but on lower wages. Osman Dembele and their agent had some different plans, let's just say, because they wanted a long term contract. That's fine. But on hefty hefty wages yes the wages that can be compared to Lionel Messi's wages not that high but still that high and Barcelona straight up refused Barcelona just couldn't offer it and hell broke loose shit broke loose and Barcelona publicly went on stating that they are trying to offload Osman Dembele in the January transfer window they are looking at every opportunity but he stayed in Barcelona and now Maybe he's stuck, maybe he might enjoy the fo Xavi football, but in sun at Sunday again against Athletic Bilbao, Osman Dembele produced a performance which wasn't expected out of him. He came on as a sub in the sixth substitute in the 66th minute and the camp no was full of boos. The booing was heard everywhere when Dembele got subbed in, but he scored one goal and provided two assists which lit up the camp no and Barcelona won. 4-0 against Athletic Bilbao. Then Xavi and Lopota gave public statements saying that yes, we hope Dembele resolves his situation. We want to keep him. We hope we find a solution. Shit like that. And again, we are at ground zero. Barcelona wants to keep Dembele. Dembele wants to stay, but for the money. Let's 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 hear my opinion. Should Barcelona renew Osman Dembele? Should Osman Dembele still be at the camp? No next season i think not i think it shouldn't be done why firstly let's look at the injury history of osman dembele this guy has been injured the moment he came in barcelona his injury history if you look just goes on and on and on and on it never stops sometimes it's the hamstring sometimes it's this sometimes it's that but he has been injured more times then the goals he has scored, I must say, it's over exaggerating. But still, he has been out for so long, and it's he's not just not trustworthy enough. Should Barcelona risk their wage structure again for a player who might not even play a full season? He's 24 years old. He has a lot of potential. That's why Barcelona want to keep him. But his injuries, his constant injuries, is too too expensive for Barcelona I must say because they can't they can't keep a player who won't play that much when when Barcelona has 
a lot of attacking options. They got Aubameyang, Traore, now they have Gavi from La Masaya. They have so much. Why would they need Dembele who is not motivated, who doesn't want to stay there, who wants to stay there for the money? Things should be different. Barcelona should let him go in the summer, invest that funds and the wages they free up in Haaland. Go try for Haaland. Maybe it's expensive. Doesn't matter. Go for Haaland. Real Madrid get Mbappe. You need someone. Get Haaland. And develop the La Masaya youngsters. You have such a great academy. You have such great players coming. Xavi has produced uh, Pedri. So Pedri was produced in the Roland Coman. But still Xavi is helping Pedri thrive. Gavi. Then Nicole Zaniolo. Ricky Puj. And maybe someone else. There are so many players. I don't fo follow Barcelona that much. But still... There are so many things Barcelona can do better instead of giving Osman Dembele what he wants. That is a long-term contract with high wages. Personally, it would be the biggest, biggest disappointment if Dembele secures a contract at Camp Nou at higher wages because he, he, he doesn't deserve it. Scoring 32 goals in five and a half years, has he justified his price tag of over 100 million pounds that Barcelona spent has he done that? How can Barcelona even think of renewing the contract? It's beyond my words. They should let him go in the summer, sign someone enthusiastic, someone who wants to play in the Camp Nou. That is what Barcelona should be aiming for. Yes, Osman Dembele is good. He will, he will succeed wherever he goes. He will develop. He has a lot of potential, but not enough to be at Barcelona. Firstly, because injuries. Second, not motivated enough, I feel like. Else, time will tell. Maybe Xavi changes his mind. Maybe Osman Dembele likes the way Barcelona is playing. Maybe he softens his stance. Things can happen over time. You never know. But right now, they should let him go. That's it. That's the point of the video. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. What are your thoughts? Tell me. Comment down below. What do you think that Barcelona should do with Osman Dembele? And how the club should go ahead without the youngster who's, who's developing greatly? Like, share and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Until then, see ya.